Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Bizlift NG. And this YouTube channel basically talks about Facebook ads. We talk about Instagram ads, how you can leverage platforms like Facebook and Instagram to grow your visibility and also increase your sales. Right, now this particular video that you're watching, of course, I'm sure you can see that the setup is a bit different. Yes, we're trying to just, you know, diversify a lot of things. Now, this particular video, I want to talk to you about WhatsApp ads. Now, WhatsApp ads is one of the fastest growing platforms that you can now run ads. People have been asking me about how to run ads directly from their phone using the WhatsApp app, right? I'm not going to be showing you that right now. Of course, in another video, I'm going to show you that. But right now, I want to show you how you can run WhatsApp ads right from the ads manager. Now, currently, WhatsApp ads is one of the cheapest ads that you can run. I've seen a lot of people asking which platform works best and all that. Yes, there are other platforms like Instagram DM. You can run ads directly to your Instagram DM. You can also run ads to WhatsApp. But WhatsApp is a lot cheaper. And if you're someone who, like, I mean, you have a lot of money to spend, you can leverage WhatsApp ads to get quality leads and sell even more. Let me show you exactly how it works. Of course, I'm sure you can see my screen already. So um, I'm going to just go ahead and create a sample ad to show you exactly what I'm talking about, right? Okay, so um, I'm right here on the Ads Manager, as you can see. So I'm going to just click on Create, and then I'm going to create a new ad, right? If you follow carefully, you click on... Now, we want to create an ad for WhatsApp, right? That will make people message us on WhatsApp, right? So what do we use? We're going to use engagement for this ad, right? Click engagement and then we click on continue. Then we use a manual engagement campaign and then we click on continue. So let's go over it carefully, one after the other. Please pay attention as I'm going to be explaining a few things as we move on, all right? So now this is the first level. Remember what I always say, there are three levels to every ad campaign that you run. So this um, is the first level. So basically at this first level, we're just going to name it um whatsapp right let's call it whatsapp campaign okay and then we'll scroll down and then we move next we're not going to talk about the a b test or the advantage budget campaign not yet okay so let's just go to the ad set level now the ad set level we can scroll down now under the conversion location what you want to choose is messaging apps messaging apps is what you want to choose right Okay, so choose messaging apps. Then the next thing you do is after choosing messaging apps, scroll down, right? Then the ad type is always going to be click to message, not sponsored message. So click to message. Once you've chosen that, choose your corresponding Facebook, uh, Facebook page that you're using for this ad and then your Instagram account. Now for this type of ad, I'm going to connect, I'm going to have to connect a phone number, right? It is usually very easy, okay? So now, if your WhatsApp is not connected, basically all you have to do is just connect it, okay? Let's just do that right away here. I can also do that right here and just connect my phone number here, okay? Then click continue, then I'm going to just connect. Now, you can connect as many WhatsApp number as you want to, but remember, it has to be a WhatsApp business phone number. You know that there's WhatsApp business and there's normal WhatsApp. So before you can run this type of ad, you need to have a WhatsApp business account, okay? So I'm using my WhatsApp business account. The, uh, the code has just dropped. I'm going to just put in the code right here, okay? And then I'm going to click on confirm. So once this is done, my WhatsApp number or WhatsApp business number is going to be linked for this particular ad. So what happens is the ad directly comes to my WhatsApp on my phone, okay? So um, so yes, you can see it says busy is now connected to your WhatsApp. So good, we've connected uh, the WhatsApp, that's fine. Now, once you're connected, ensure that there's no other thing turned on here aside from WhatsApp. So I'm going to turn off the messenger and leave just WhatsApp right there, okay? So now, what are you maximizing for? What is your performance goal? The performance goal is maximize number of conversations because you want to generate conversations, people messaging you. You don't just want people to click your link. You don't just want them to, uh, 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 yeah, you don't just want link clicks. You want conversations. People should come into your DM asking, making inquiries, chatting with you. That is what you want, okay? So we're gonna optimize our, our performance goal to be for conversations. Once that is done, now, for a start, I want you to use at least 7,000 to daily budget for a start. So for this, I'm gonna be using 10,000 a daily. Okay, for a start, right? This gives you quality, quality messages. Don't get, don't get me wrong. 
quality messages is what it gives you, okay? And then your end date or the date or duration you should run this ad for should be at least for two weeks. Two weeks of running this ad. So that's 14 days. So that will be 29th if I'm, if I'm correct, okay? So once you have done this, the next thing you want to do is to come to your audience location. Of course, set your location. Please always ensure that you use a maximum of three to four locations per advert. Very, be I mean, it's, it's best that way. So for this ad, I'm using Lagos, I'm using Ibadan or your state. Um, these two alone for this ad, okay? So I've said that already. So the next thing I'm going to scroll down to my Advantage Plus audience. This is the AI platform that Meta has given us to help us uh, suggest to Meta some type of audience or the type of audience we want and then meta takes this information to look for these audiences and even help us optimize it better so i'm going to use that audience suggestion by clicking on audience suggestion there and then i'll set the age range that i want okay set the age range i want an age of 25 right 25 to an age of to an age of 50 okay so i'm going to set 25 to 50 Gender, I'm going to make it women, okay? Gender, I'm going to make it women, okay? Just follow me closely. Now, the next thing I want to do, because we are using... Now, for some accounts, you will be able to put in your detailed targeting. But for this account, this ad account is a new ad account, so they are not letting us use um, audiences. They want us to use a broad audience, which is fine if your product is for a specific gender. Right? If your product is for a specific gender, you can go broad. But if your product is for both genders and you need to specify based on interest, then you can do the interest. If not, you can do a custom audience if you want to. You can also use a custom audience if you would want to. Okay, Very simple. So once this is done, we're going to come to placement and um, use a manual placement of Instagram alone because that's where I want most of my audiences to come from. So I'm going to turn off the rest and leave Instagram alone right here, okay? And that's what we have there. So we have Instagram. Now, bear with you that this is saying that we're going to have zero conversations, which is absolutely wrong. Remember that this is just an estimation. It's just an estimate. It doesn't really mean that that is exactly what is going to happen. So don't bother yourself about what the estimate looks like. Just leave it the way it is and click Next, okay? Click Next. And then, of course, this last part is where we're going to put in our post for the ad, okay? We're going to put in our post for the ad right here. Okay, I'm going to select a post for Instagram. Okay, this is very simple, very simple. So let's say I want to use this video where we are talking about a CapCut editing um, arc, which we posted. So I'm going to just click on Done. Now, because this post was actually a collaborated post, um, Okay, so the post is uploading. Okay, so the post is uploading. Once it's, once it's done uploading, I will be able to publish this ad. But of course, because this um, particular post is a collaborated post, I need to take permission from my main page, which is BizLift, before I can publish this ad. But I, I hope you understand what I'm trying to say. WhatsApp ads is one of the cheapest you can run currently. You'll be spending somewhere around less than 100 naira if you're in Nigeria, and as low as less than a dollar or about a dollar if you are outside Nigeria or any other European country, WhatsApp ads can improve your leads. If, you are, if your business depends on lead generation, you can use WhatsApp ads to generate leads. Let them come into your DM, make inquiries. You can follow up on them. You can now convert them fully. You can even build a broadcast list. And then you keep sending valuable information to those people who have messaged you, have showed interest. WhatsApp is good because of the personal touch, the, 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 that personal touch, that human touch that it has, where you can message people, they can call you, you can receive their calls, and you can re respond to them. I think this is one of the reasons why I love WhatsApp ads. So are you going to be trying this type of ad? What other video would you like me to share on this um, channel for you to watch and learn from? Leave it in the comment section. And if you've watched thus far, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and also give it a thumbs up so that a lot of people can see this video. Remember to also leave a comment and let me know the next video you want me to create or what questions you have concerning Facebook ads, Instagram ads, any type of ad. I'm going to be talking more about them. I'm going to be responding to them in the comment section. Thank you guys so much for your time. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Bye.